Hello, Dr. Hubner here, Natural Transplants, and I wanted to introduce everyone to the HUE. This is a trademarked uh, process by which we basically move more hair than anyone else in the world and achieve more density than anyone else. So HUE, or the HU, stands for High Yield Unit Extraction. And I wanted to talk to you about what that entails. This is not to be confused with the FU or the F-U-E. We joke around and say the FU gives you very few hairs. Uh, it is a process, as you know, F-U-E, the standard F-U-E that a lot of surgeons use now. Uh, and they tout F-U-E because they don't want people to have a linear scar. Some people have seen horrible pictures of scars in the back of the head, popsicle sticks, in the back of the head so they say well if you don't want that get the FUE and what that entails is a pricey process of individually taking little circles or mini plugs from the back of the donor area and this results in getting very little density and very little hair you can achieve more than double or triple the amount of hair with the HUE process the HUE process is basically a take on the strip traditional strip method but in a way that will achieve more density and more hair. So HUE stands for High Yield Unit Extraction. What does this mean? High yield has to do with our technicians, the experience that they have, the yield and efficiency in which the grafts are cut as opposed to FUE, in which many times it's a blind technique or even in a robot, the artist, while it's better than say a human, still has a higher transaction rate because more or less it's a blind technique. When you're making the cut or the punch from an FUE, you cannot see the follicle. So if you have a curvier hair or if you're not lined up in the right plane, a lot of times the follicle will get transected, you'll get a graft that won't grow. As opposed to a traditional strip method, and in our case, an HUE in which you can easily see the follicle edges lined up whenever a cut incision is made to make a graft everything is visualized and the efficiency of our grafts and the survival rate of grafts is much higher so what sets HUE or the HUE apart from the standard FUT or strip procedure high yield obviously with the technicians people don't often ask enough questions when they go and do their research about the types of technicians used are these technicians doing hair every day? Are these technicians assistants or medical uh, assistants at a plastic surgery office that do this one day a week? Uh, makes a big difference. To get good at anything, to become an expert at anything, it needs repetition, it needs practice. This is all we do every day. The technicians that I use have been doing this every day for over 17 years. So that's one of the big reasons that uh, our efficiency is so high. High yield, meaning efficiency. Unit extraction, so the units that we cut, basically we extract a longer strip, a bigger strip, a wider strip than your standard uh, strip method that you'll get at other doctors. We guarantee a strip that's 30 centimeters long, often longer, um, and one centimeter wide. We, at minimum, will guarantee you 30 square centimeters of tissue. People also never ask when they do the research how much tissue is being removed from the back of the head and being transplanted. A lot of doctors don't know or can't tell you. I've seen people that have had 20 from prior scars on the back of their head have had 20 centimeter strips, 15 centimeter strips. A lot of times the hair on the side is not utilized. So people get less hair, but they don't know any better because they're paying a certain amount of money per graft. A lot of the bigger grafts just get chopped up into single hair grafts and they get charged five times as much and get very small grafts and very little density. And that's what I see the most of the time. Okay, so at minimum 30 square centimeters of tissue. That's the standard HUE, H-U-E. We also have an upgrade from that, which in certain individuals can qualify for a HUE plus. A hue plus is basically where we take the hue strip, which again is at minimum 30 square centimeters of hair, which at 200 hairs per square centimeter yields you approximately 6,000 hairs. After the strip is removed, 
depending on the elasticity of the skin, meaning that if I can get the edges to come together very easily or even overlap very easily, there's more tissue that we can take. So often people will be offered the option of going for extra, maybe getting a case and a half or even two cases as opposed to a standard case. They're already in the chair, they're already here, they already have to go through the recovery, so why wouldn't you move as much hair as possible? Sometimes people are able to fill their entire head, meaning front to back. They can fill the front and the crown with one procedure. This is very, very different than anywhere else you would go. A lot of places would just give you a band in the front, perhaps get a third of the way back, and they run out of hair. And they're also using smaller grafts. So Hue Plus is never guaranteed, so we don't know until we know that you have the elasticity. So this is an option, sort of an add-on, that people can opt for if they want. So I would encourage you, if you're interested in these processes, please call our office, naturaltransplants.com, 844-327-HAIR, it's 4247. Uh, we speak with Jerry, our sales guy. Uh, we're very open, accessible. I'm very happy to talk to anyone on FaceTime or Skype or anything else, that, any way I can talk to them on the phone. It's fine, I would love to educate our patients, our potential clients about the process. It doesn't have to be scary. You can see from the videos on our website, it's a very easy process and actually an enjoyable process to go through. So please give us a call. The HU and the HU, HUE and the Q Plus are new additions to the Natural Transplants Arsenal of products. Thanks so much.